Hey, what's going on, guys? How's everybody doing today? I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. The body beat down here, Michael, on this Thursday afternoon. Today's deadlift day, and if I choose to do anything else, uh, I can do that as well. However, today I will not be doing that. Uh, we're just sticking with some deadlifts. I'll break it to you right now. Nothing great will happen. I pretty much get frustrated and just kind of give up at the end of six sets. <clears throat> I don't push myself and I just kind of I got frustrated uh, for those of you that know what I'm dealing with with my stupid hand it's just frustrating and, and you got to understand yes I can use my gloves and my straps and stuff like that but at the same time when you have goals for yourself when you hold yourself kind of accountable or whatever to do things a certain way and you expect yourself to do things a certain way and uh uh, and when you don't do it, you make yourself unhappy. So uh, I don't want to sit there and keep cutting corners using gloves and straps because to me that's what it is. Uh, I'd rather do things raw. I like the feel of it. I like the way it makes me feel mentally. I, I just like it all. So uh, although you will see me use gloves time to time, and I even tried straps a couple times here and there, uh, it's all fine and dandelion. But when it comes down to my just straight up working out, I just like to feel raw. I like to feel like I'm doing it the way I'm wanting to do it. Because if I don't do it that way, then I'm not making myself happy or proud. I'm appeasing the audiences, but that's not what it's about. It's appeasing yourself. And uh, if you're not doing that, then you're, you're, you're not going to be happy either way. So, I don't know if I'm going to give myself time off from deadlifts or if I'm going to just bite the bullet and use my straps and gloves every single set and every single rep until things just feel better. I mean, I guess that's the probably the smarter thing to do, but like I said, it's just hard to get past the mental aspect of it where you feel like you're cheating yourself. And, uh, and again, it's not just about moving the weight, it's about what it does to you inside, your mental status. Uh, you know, working out is a, is a really big stimulant for you mentally. And, uh, you know, a lot of us don't do things in our lives that are just amazingly great, and sometimes this is our one claim to fame. And uh, we want to we wanna feel like we're really doing ourselves justice and uh, what we expect of ourselves. So, uh, it's just an ongoing issue, guys. You've seen it, you've heard it before, but I just need to put it out there, you know. I, we don't have control over these things sometimes, and sometimes just have setbacks. And it's odd that this is setting me back more than my horrible, chronic, disgusting back. It's so crazy. But, uh, Anyway, so at the at the end of this video, I'm gonna have a, a closing and talk about things. I may cover the same stuff again, so for that I apologize. But uh, you know, uh, just stick around and uh, we'll have a little conversation at the end, anyways. And uh, so you see, I'm, you know, I'm using my gloves. Not a big deal. Not happy, as you can tell. And uh, that's just the way it goes. So uh, yeah. So we're going to be done with this, and then we're going to get to the closing uh, discussion. So thanks, guys, for watching, and uh, stick around. Well, guys, that's all I'm doing today. I'm making myself upset every time I deadlift now. So uh, if you're not in it 100%, uh, anything's better than nothing. But instead of continuing on and uh, pissing yourself off, Maybe call it a day so you can just kind of gain your thoughts and all that good stuff and uh, try to get yourself back where you need to be. Uh, the deadlifts are kicking my butt now. Um, so anyway, I'm not used to failing at things. I'm used to pushing through and uh, even my horrible back don't hold me back anymore. So yeah, anyway guys. Short video, sorry, I hope it gives you a little inspiration on a little bit of reality check that, you know, all of us go through these things. And, uh, it's just the way it is, guys. Again, the old saying goes, any workout's better than no workout. And that is true, however, it's still upsetting to 
uh, let yourself down. And uh, if you know if you're not letting yourself down at some point, then you obviously don't have any goals, and you need goals to keep yourself pushed and motivated. So I have goals, and if I'm not making myself happy, then you know that's a problem. So. Anyway, there's always another day, and we're going to do better next time. All right, guys? Like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff to the Body Beat Down. That's me, Michael, your incredible host. And uh, get up, get out, get rad, do it, Jen. We'll see you next time on the Body Beat Down. Get up, get out, get rad, and do it, do it.